What's going on guys? It's Maximinator here and today it's gonna be a brand new series episode of fucking I don't know. Um Dr. Phil has no chill. So I, I just uh stubborn stubborn stopped on this video. I just found this video like former gang member gives fifteen year old wannabe gangster a reality check. Okay. So, yeah, let's see what the shit about. I wasn't sure Dawson really understood what his future could look like if he keeps idealizing this criminal lifestyle. So I asked my friend Joseph to come and explain a few things to him. Uh, wait, wait. Is this, is this... I'm sorry. I'm trying not to say some stupid shit, but what the fuck? How the fuck is either his parents are tripping or he has some type of mental disease? I don't understand it. Seriously, I just I just can't. I don't understand. What? Kid, you don't want to be a gangster. Nobody. <sighs> Fuck. Joseph, come on out. Have a seat. Damn. From his eyes, I mean, they just showed his eyes. Joseph, you've been watching everything, right? Yes, sir. And um, you can look at his eyes. He's like, it's the man that saw a lot of shit, just a lot of stuff, you know. And uh, you can see in his eyes, like he's he's repented of his sins. He he knows the shit that he's done is not is not good. But mostly about this type of people, this type of people, they they don't have a life, you know. I bet there's uh, those parents' kids, uh, 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 those kids' parents, I mean, there with him, you know. Uh, I don't know much about his life, but definitely some shit was happening in his family and uh, the the financial status, the the everything, you know, these ambient factors. Where do you live? Where you live in? It's influence you, influence fuck, influence you to become a person that you are today. You know, so basically, this man saw a lot of shit and is repented for the choices that he made. So yeah, that's what that's what I see. That's what I see from here, just by analyzing this stuff. Chris and Dawn here are the parents, as you know. Oh, here it is. Fuck, the kid has parents. I mean, either his parents are tripping, or kid is dumb fuck. Because how the fuck you want to have? I mean. <laughs> You have all the life if you you have those phones, you have food on your table. Fuck, not only food on your table, but you have a life to live, you know? A lot of people don't get that. A lot of people are, are way living way worse than you. And they don't want to be gangs. They don't want to, they just want their life to be better. To strive for better. And this kid want to be a thug, as you say, because, what? It's so stupid how today's kids is like, oh my fucking God. Oh God. And uh, Dawson here is, uh, he seems to be going in an awful lot of trouble to... Look, j j j just compare them to... How the fuck... This pussy face is gangsta. I'm sorry for saying a swear word. I mean, it's a Christian channel and we have to, you know, I, I don't like to swear, but come on. That's a fucking Justin Bieber wannabe. 
I mean, not today's Justin Bieber that want to be like, oh, fuck, oh, what am I saying? Oh, my God. That's so fucking dumb. Create this thug persona. That's what I just um, said. He's got pictures of him throwing gang signs and s guns in his belt and standing in front of a pool. Throwing gang signs. It's West Side, baby. What the fuck? I mean, sometimes I really think it's just a joke. But it's not a joke. Oh, shit. Oh, God. Oh, God. You've been in the life. What do you say about this? First of all, it's disrespectful. Also, yeah. Very much. You got two loving parents right there, man. Yeah, he actually, actually, yeah, just saying what I said. It's like, it is actually disrespectful because he thinks that doing shit and having a shitty life is cool. It's not. It's not, guys. Trust me. I know. I mean, my life was way better than Joseph's here, but way better. Way better. Definitely. Uh, but uh, I saw a lot of shit that make me a little bit, uh, let's say, with, got me a little bit health issues. But still, nothing compared to this guy. So, what the fuck? You think it's cool having those problems? You think it's cool to kill uh, and get shot? Uh, probably. Um, the fuck? Some people don't have a choice and some people are retarded. I mean, not even... Maybe the kid has some issues. The fuck? So dumb. So something else is inside you that's, that's pushing you out there. But to be a gang member to think it's cool, bro, I've been shot four times. <sighs> By the time I was 25, I had 13 years incarcerated. Damn. I was first arrested at nine years old. But when I walked out of my house, it was nothing but homies. When I walked back in my house, my father was a homie. When he was not in prison. Damn. I thought those were the cards that were dealt to me. To hear you say this. Exactly. Story, As he says, it's the cards that were dealt him. It's like, it's the life he didn't choose. And that kid definitely has a great life. It blows me away, youngster. It breaks my heart. To carry a gun like, what are you going to do when somebody runs up on you and you got a strap? You're gonna pull the trigger. And then the kid doesn't doesn't even look him in the eyes because the kid realizes this that's that's that he's dumb. That he's what he cannot handle the real shit. The real pressure. You no, know? because it's easy to pick on someone who's weaker than you. But it's way harder when someone coming with a mountain upon you, you know, like, yeah, the kid is. And what you, but you, you, you can't give that life back, bro. <laughs> I don't looks think like you're he's a hard cry. kid. You don't have a heart. I don't know. You got a heart, bro. I don't know. There's nothing ah, I don't about believe. taking somebody's life. I, 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 I promise you. You were in the Dukes at 11 years old, right? Yes, sir. Is that some place he wants to be? No, sir. Disneyland is a good place to go. <laughs> That's actually true. Damn. I actually want to go to Disneyland, too. Like, I don't know. I just... Paris. Have those good lives, you know? Oh, shit. I got a clap for this man.
the street life, bro, um, I don't do the scared straight thing because you're gonna be like, ha, ah, that's what they all say. Going to prison sucks. My boys have died in my arms, man. See, this guy is a the lot videos, of you shit. Don't look, and this is no disrespect to you as a person. You don't look tough, bro, but I'm not judging you. <laughs> hey. You just gave yourself up on national TV. <laughs> you're going to jail. I was waiting for the police to come in. So your <laughs> gang career is out of, it's out of there. <laughs> it, it, no, it's really gone. It's done. Uh, as I said, he's so, oh shit, I don't want to see it. This commercials because only positivity in this stream. But all I want to say is, yeah, this guy saw a lot of shit. A lot of shit has happened. And honestly, <sighs> guys, you don't want this life. Kids, you don't want this life. Seriously, just, just study, learn new stuff. Get something you make do something you're passionate about. You have parents, you have uh, I mean not all of us, you know. Yeah, I know a lot of people grow in the circumstances of the of shit, but trust me, I know. Saw a lot of stuff too in my days. When I was a kid I, I wish I saw some stuff I wish to see some stuff. But fuck it. Seriously. Think about your future, guys. And that's the best advice I can give you. Maximinator here. Peace out. Have a great night. Subscribe, please, because I really need subscribers. And I need likes. I need everything. Seriously, if you subscribe right now, just click right now, you get a chopper dropping a Lamborghini on your head. Just, just, just go. I'm offering only today Lamborghinis if you subscribe or like. If in like, subscribe and like, if you already subscribed, just like, you will get your Lambo waiting for you. Yeah, thank you guys for watching. Waiting for you, not really, because it's gonna fall down on you. Click it right now. If you don't believe me, click it. If you do believe me, click it anyway. Peace out, guys.